Day 84 of the Captain's Log, April 11th. It's a beautiful sea day, and it's another Oceans Ahead presentation. Got a couple of questions. So we're gonna do some rapid fire. First one, do you ever think you'll captain an Alaska cruise? It goes hand in hand with the next question, do captains ever switch ships? The answer is yes. We switch ships, switch ships, switch ships, switch ships, switch ships, switch ships. You gotta be careful with that. Every two to three years. I joined Celebrity Cruises in 2015. Celebrity Beyond is the fourth ship that I've been on. So we can go basically to any ship, any itinerary. But I'm hoping that I get to stick around Celebrity Beyond for a little bit because this is my baby. Wendy wanted to know, is there anywhere to see the map of where the ship is in real time? If you go into the live TV and the navigation channel, you can see not only where we've been, but where we currently are. And there's also a camera on the bridge that shows you what it looks like outside. Christopher from Canada wants to know what percentage of Scottish heritage is in my name? McHugh, M-C-C-U-E. We traced it back the last time we went to Scotland. We belonged to Clan Mackay, spelled McKay. The Black Watch is our tartan. What percentage? I'm not sure. I still need to do one of those 23andMe or Ancestry.com tests, so stay tuned. <laughs> Rob from London had me worried with this one because he said, how does it feel to have your Wikipedia occupation as internet personality? Well, I went straight to Wikipedia and it says cruise ship captain. I don't wanna be an internet personality. <laughs> Dr. Al wants to know what's the ship's maximum speed and how fast can you stop the ship from the maximum speed? So these are tests that we perform during the new build process. We clocked our maximum speed at 22.3 knots, which is about 25.6 miles per hour through the water. And for the stopping distance, when we go from full sea speed to full stop, we call that a crash stop, and we test it a couple of different ways. What we found is our crash stop takes five minutes and three seconds and 1,553 meters to do the full stop. One test we do it manually by manipulating the azipods and turning them around, and then we also have a crash stop stop button where we just push the button and it will automatically rotate the azipods to bring us down in speed. That was something new to Celebrity Cruises when Celebrity Beyond was launched. Once we've completed all of the tests, including the maximum speed, the crash stop, and turning circle radius, we post that on the bridge so we have the information readily available. This one I feel really bad about because Tom is asking about how many cat access doors are there on Beyond. If you saw my post from April 1st, it was April 1st. We don't actually have cat doors on Celebrity Beyond. That was April Fool's. The last two questions are also bug related. If she gets sick at sea, do I have a vet? We actually order a mobile vet if she needs it. That's what we did during the pandemic when we couldn't get off the ship. A mobile vet came to the ship. And does Bug have her own life jacket? You betcha. After my talk in the theater, we had Bug trivia at 11.15 and I was feline prepared. I just got a call to run down to the deck four galley because we've got a leak. 